Well, hello, beautiful. Hello, gorgeous. Hello, handsome. I'm Monica Hill. Welcome to my channel or welcome back. Looks like I have one more subscriber since this morning. I'm going to praise the Lord. Let the church say amen. Hallelujah, somebody. Okay. I'm going to send a shout out to my church family for giving all the ladies roses today. And if you are a doubting Thomas, log on to my church service and you can see that for yourself. Okay. I know somebody out there saying, hmm, what else? They can say, where do those roses come from? Where do you get these roses? Uh, my church family. Okay. <laughs> But listen, I just want to show you how my hair turned out. I just put up, my hair was not dry. I took, put my scarf on, rolled to church, took my scarf off before I got in the church building and it was still wet. So of course it did not set right, but I came home, I put a little bit of my super holding um, flaxseed gel right where I needed to put it. I might, you might see a little white cast. I uh, laid a little edge down on the side. I already had these right here. Now I do miss my little tresses. I like my little, little tresses on the side, so I might go back and do that. But let me just show you very quickly how I'm going to maintain my little ponytail, okay? I don't know if I'm going to keep it for a whole 30 days, but I probably will restyle it a few times, okay? All right, but I'm just going to show you. I'm going to take a stocking, one of the legs of a pair of stockings, honey. It had a ruin on this side, clean pair of my stockings, so I took it and I cut it, okay? <laughs> I'm going to just put my stocking cap over the ponytail part. Let me just show you this part. I just took and plaited my hair at the top. See that? I just have a chunky plait there. All right, all right, all right. And I folded it over and I tucked the end into my little twist. All right, and that's it. Let me get it back in there. All right, and that's my little, my little ponytail. Okay, I can move it up, move it to the side, whatever. And then I'll, I'll put probably, maybe try to put something. I really want a glossifier. Wanna, I want my hair to just really just be like, really just shiny. Just something to sit on top of it and just, woo, just make it shine. But let me show you my waves, okay? I have waves for days, days in the back of my head, all right? Can you sit, can you sit, can you sit? Woo, don't hurt yourself, honey. Baby, don't hurt yourself. Look it, all right, can you see those waves? Can you count the waves? Oh, could you see? Let me turn to the other side. Did you get a view? Oh. Let me help you out. Woo! Don't don't hurt yourself. Just take it slow, all right? Take it slow. Can you see them? Can you? Ooh, baby. Can you see the ocean waves? All right? All right. Now, some people's hair is just uh, very slick, and they don't have waves. It's like looking up at the midnight sky, okay? You might you find little stars, up, uh, you know, whatever. But mine is the opposite, honey. You look down from the sky and you're looking at the ocean, unless you look at some trees or something like that. This could be the tree, all right? This is the ocean back here, baby. Ocean, black ocean, all right, with all those waves. But moving right along so I can end this video, I am going to take my stocking cap. And by the way, I'm not going to leave my elastic band on at nighttime. I'm going to take it off and... Uh, yeah, let my scalp get some air up there. But I'm just gonna gently place the stocking cap over the top, not tight at all. And just bring the rest of it down. This is gonna keep my hair in place from being frizzy and sticking up and all that type of stuff, all right? So that's what I do, that's what I do. And then my scarf is going to keep my hair, it's gonna protect my hair. My little silky, silky going on, okay? All right, so I'm just gonna tie this on my head. And yeah, that's how I be going to bed, all right? <laughs> that's how I be going to bed. That's all I wanted to show you. All righty, all righty. You can tie it however you want to tie it, you know, tie it around your little ponytail there, tie it in a little knot. So, I had a beautiful day. Thank you, God, for loving me, for loving us so, for a beautiful Sabbath day. And uh, I just want to share with you, if you would like to learn more about God's Word and prophecy and what's happening and what's going to happen in the future, one of the pastors that I consider my own, and I've never met him, is Doug Batchelor online. You can go to amazingfacts.com or you can look up on YouTube at Doug, on Doug Batchelor. I look up the name Doug Batchelor and you'll see that he has a fabulous ministry. 
and um, you can listen to the videos. They have a segment called Bible Answers Live. There's a, I believe, 800 number you can call and ask Bible questions live when they're on the air. I don't know the station and the number right off, but you can find out all the information. And then in a lot of the videos, in a lot of the videos, they will give you a number to text if you would like free literature about the subjects that they're talking about. So be blessed. This is the, the great controversy talking about what's going on in the world, in the universe right now. Bible lesson to study. So I want to send a shout out to everybody on my channel. Um, thank you, God, for my subscribers. Lord, I ask that you will bless them, Lord, spiritually, physically, mentally, socially, economically, in all the ways, Lord, with their health, with their mind, with their spirit, with their family, with their relationships, education, all the, in all the ways, Lord. I ask that you will forgive us for our sins, Lord. Help us to be overcomers and help us to be be ready when you come and to overcome evil with good. In Christ's name I pray, amen. All right, I'm praying for you. God bless you. Thank you for my new subscriber and uh, have an amazing evening. All right, I'll see you or you'll see me in my next video.